What makes the M6000 a must-have is the integrated oxygen concentrator. It will eliminate the need for high pressure tanks at your hospital. That and the many safety features, especially the patented safety pressure relief valve. Once you turn on the oxygen concentrator, it will start producing oxygen immediately. It takes about 45 seconds for that oxygen to reach the USP 93 setting. Once that's the case, it is ready to use for anesthesia. You'll notice that the concentrator has built-in audible and visual alarms. These alarms will let you know if the concentration is not adequate or if the unit is to lose power. I will now demonstrate what that alarm sounds like if you are to lose power. In the event of a power outage, simply turn on your backup tank, switch the toggle switch from main to auxiliary, and adjust your flow rate accordingly. Each PureLine oxygen concentrator has two filters. There's a coarse particle filter, which can be accessed by removing this panel. This filter can be washed when visibly dirty. We recommend using a mild dish soap like a Dawn and warmed water. Once it is dry, you may reinstall the filter. Right behind that filter is a fine particle inlet filter. This filter needs to be replaced yearly. The oxygen is supplied directly to the precision flow meter. You can adjust your flow rates using the flow control valve. Our flow control valves have a built-in mechanical stop, which will protect it from being over-tightened. From there, the oxygen will flow through the vaporizer to our common gas outlet. The common gas outlet is a standard 15 millimeter fitting, which will allow you to easily plug in your non-rebreathing circuits. When the common gas outlet is together, the oxygen will flow to the rebreathing head and be supplied to your patient. From there, the CO2 will be absorbed through this canister, which is a single seal canister, which allows easy removal and eliminates leaks. Our canisters come with a lifetime warranty. All superior anesthesia machines come with an industry standard 30 liter per minute flush. This flush includes a safety shield so it can't accidentally be depressed. One of the key features on all superior anesthesia machines is our patented safety pressure relief valve. This valve, unlike others, is going to do two things for me. One, it's going to regulate the airway pressure if I need to manually ventilate a patient. And two, it can never be left closed accidentally. To demonstrate that, if I have a patient on the circuit and I need to breathe for them, all I have to do is simply hold down this plunger and as you can see, the bag will start to fill. At any point, I can breathe for that patient knowing that the airway pressure will never go above 25 centimeters of water. Even when completely full, you'll notice that it'll stop at 25 centimeters of water. Once I release the plunger, it is wide open again. To run a leak test on this machine, I simply dial down the disc, close the plunger, give it a little flush here. I like to build the pressure to 30 centimeters of water. As you can see, this machine is leak free. But notice, the moment that I walk away, this valve will automatically open. Therefore, it is impossible to leave it closed accidentally. One of the key features of the M6000 is our stable A-frame design. As you can see, it is just an 18 by 18 inch square base, which will save valuable floor space. With the concentrator mounted to this frame, it gives it a very low and stable center of gravity. All superior anesthesia machines come standard with an IV pole and two universal mounts. The second universal mount can be used to mount accessories like the universal control arm and vane circuit. Another key feature of the M6000 is the built-in organizer. This will house your rebreathing bags as well as your anesthesia circuits. For more information on the M6000 and other Sapira products, please reach out to your local Covetris representative.